In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to dimension in AutoCAD. And the benefits to this is that you are creating clear, transparent plans, and it saves contractors time in the field by not having to measure your landscape plan. So to dimension in AutoCAD, you stay under the Home tab, and under the Home tab, there's this annotation section. You can drop down for more options, but we're going to concentrate on this dimension stringer. And underneath are different options. For example, you could do aligned if you wanted to draw on an angle, angular, arc length, diameter. But for this tutorial, we're going to do linear. And make sure your O-snap is turned on so you could grab the end of these points. If not, you won't get the exact dimension. So turn O-snap mode on and click on the two destinations that you want the stringer to be and then you simply drag up. Now, depending on AutoCAD's default settings, you might get a dimension stringer that is very difficult to read. But in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to change the properties and customize so you can always use the same one. And to do that, highlight the dimension stringer, right click and open up properties. Within the properties, you can change the arrows. For example, we have a closed filled arrow, but maybe you want an architectural tick We'll change those for both. And the arrow size, it's difficult to read, but we're gonna go to six inches. The text is also difficult to read. So because six inches worked on the arrow, I'm gonna use six inches on the text. And we can see that it is in decimals. So we're gonna to need to scroll down and find the area where we can change it to architectural, located in primary units. So we're going to change this to architectural. And here we can also show the precision and now that you have one dimension string you're in, you can go back to this area. And if we wanted to use the aligned dimension stringer and send it across the side here, we could see AutoCAD is defaulting to the settings. But we could use match properties, select the one that we just did, and it automatically changes the new. For more tutorials, trainings, or digital products, go to www.thelandscapelibrary.com and subscribe now.